My name is Justin Reed. Um, I'm from Traverse City, Michigan. I currently am in HUD. I uh, rent from an apartment. Um, I used to be homeless. I used to be one of those people who thought it was okay to go ahead and be somebody who had issues, who had mental illness, who had, was, was going from job to job, from job to job, and never really thinking about how not having support or structure in my life would matter. Um, I went ahead and I, I was, my advice was from a friend of mine who told me to go ahead and to try to get help. And I went through the Goodwill program and I was able to get access to housing. I was also able to go ahead and go through um, community mental health. I was able to go ahead and achieve so much in so much time, and it was and it was evident with my my memory loss, my schizophrenia, and I'm not afraid to talk to anybody about my mental illness. I think our one of the car, core components is housing and mental illness and other social programs. We need to tell our Congress that we can't cut these programs. These programs are essential to having a healthy society. And all the stories that, are, that have been present, presented today show that we are human. And that's part of our humanity, is we need to look out for each other. Um, and in the sense that, um, that I, with with the structure that I'm in, with housing, with mental illness, I don't have to go to a hospital. I don't have to go ahead and have the extra cost of going to a hospital or a psychiatric unit. I am able to accomplish having a house, well not a house, but having an apartment, and also having a a a a purpose. And that's including advocating, that's including going to, talking with our U.S. and our state um, legislation, and, you know, just to, just to go ahead and have that void filled. Um, one other thing is that it's, this, this speech that I'm doing is, it's, it's very, very, very hard. But I'm able to do it because I'm able to push. And I'm able to go ahead and not everybody is able to push. But that's why we have other people advocating for, for other people. That way their voices could be heard. And it's time that we go ahead and we let Congress know that, you know, that we need to go ahead and have our voices expressed and have our humanity with us saying that, you know, it's it's, we, sh we need the support. And some people, they don't want the support, but, but we cannot go ahead, and this is not a one-time thing. We need to go ahead and talk with our Congress multiple times. And we will never rest until we go ahead and become positive as a society to go ahead and have these programs to help out people. Thank you very much.